Hello, awesome people. I hope you're having a great day today. Today we're taking a look at the 24-page short story Rattler by R.S. Belcher, um, which was published in this collection that we're doing a deep dive into, the Weird Wild West stuff for your entertainment. Uh, we're doing a deep dive into the Weird West because I got obsessed with a science fiction te weird western um, combination with a spy genre and steampunk feel called The Wild Wild West in the 60s. It's 104 episodes long. Um, and then I've also done Legend, the UPN TV show. Um, I finished up the Adventures of Briscoe County Jr. a couple of weeks ago. Um, now And then I was watching a serial starring Gene Autry from 1935 called The Phantom Empire, which is a Western uh, science fiction take combo. Uh, so uh, there you are. I've continued to do a deep dive. I've read books. I've read short stories. Uh, I've read comics. Uh, you know, I've been doing a deep dive into it. And since this channel cares about reviews of science fiction, fantasy, and horror, and the Weird West combines those three genres with Western, it just, it just fits what I'm trying to do with this channel. So since they fit well together, we're doing a deep dive into it. Now, today we're taking a look at Rattler uh, by R.S. Belcher, who goes by Rod. Kind of like R.A. Salvatore's first name is Robert, so he goes by Rob. By Bob, I'm sorry, Bob to his friends. So this guy goes by Rod. Um, this was my second favorite short story in this collection. I'm going to be giving it a 7 out of 10. So let's read his bio. He doesn't have a Wikipedia page. So instead, we're going to be looking at his bio uh, that's here uh, in this book uh, that I'll link you to in the comments below. Um... He's an award-winning newspaper and magazine editor and reporter. Uh, he's been a private investigator, a DJ, a comic book writer, and a bunch of other things, too. And his degrees in criminal law, psychology, and justice administration from Virginia Commonwealth Elementary. He's the grand prize winner of the Star Trek Strange New Worlds uh, anthology contest. The short story Orphans was published in Star Trek Strange New Worlds uh, by Simon & Schuster in 2006. His first novel was Six Gun Ter Terret, published by Torbux. 2003, uh, so he's published about four or five more books uh, since then, and according to his bio, he was born in Roanoke, Virginia, and he has a family. So there you go. Uh, there are There's information about Mr. Uh, Belcher, R.S. Belcher for you. Uh, so this is a pub story, obviously, that was published in this 2015 collection. So this one, this one was, was published. Again, it's my second favorite short story here. I'm going to be giving a 7 out of 10. It's 24 uh, pages long. I knocked it out last night. It took me about 47 or 48 minutes for me to knock it out. Uh, this short story follows a group of professional uh, criminals who uh, leave a train um, and flee to a nearby town that's called Black Fang uh, that's a lot seedier uh, than it looks and bad things are going to happen to our protagonists, which aren't exactly protagonists that you're rooting for since they're bad guys. It's pretty seedy. It's a lot of fun. Uh, this story has two of the Weird West genres in it, fantasy and horror. It has fantasy elements, uh, which are done in a horror-like way. So both of those elements are a part of this. So it combines horror and fantasy and westerns in an old western setting in, the, uh, in Arizona. It's a lot of fun. A lot of great things are happening in this short story. Um, and I think that, uh, you know, you know, Mr. Belcher does a great job with his detail. His writing's fine. Uh, it left me wanting more. It was suspenseful. It used its length well. It had strong character arcs, particularly for a couple of our main characters, um, and growth. So I enjoyed it and where it, where it wound up. And there was a nice little ending in the last paragraph that I also liked a lot, too, of the ending of how, how it left me. And again, leaving you wanting more it is exactly what you want out of a short story. And this is my second favorite short story or comic I've read in this genre so far. Although I'm only like eight <laughs> into this genre so far. I'm still kind of a newbie. But there you are. Uh, so there you are. That is Rattler by R. S. Belcher in this collection. Again, I'll link you to it in the comments below. Have you read it or anything else by him? Uh, if so, let me know what you think about this short story in the comments below. I try to keep my reviews spoiler free as a reminder, uh, so this won't go into any spoilers. It only gives you the basic sort of concept and premise of what's happening in the first couple of pages and leaves you to it. Um, and then that's it. I'll go ahead and leave you to it. If you enjoyed this video, why not hit that subscribe button? There's going to be a lot more of these to follow. And then finally, I want to thank you so much for taking some time out of your day and investing it and watching my video. We all have so many things that are happening in our lives, and we're pulled so many different directions. So the fact that you spent this time with me is incredibly humbling, and I appreciate it. So thanks again, and have an amazing day.